Hi, my name is Mrs. Bartz and I'm an occupational therapist at Cleveland Metropolitan School District. And today I'm gonna to read a story called Click Clack Moo, Cows That Type. This book was written by Doreen Cronin with pictures by Betsy Lewin. Farmer Brown has a problem. His cows like to type. All day long he hears click clack moo, click clack moo, clickety clack moo. At first he couldn't believe his ears. Cows that type? Impossible. Click clack moo, click clack moo, clickety clack moo. Then he couldn't believe his eyes. They typed him a note. It says, Dear Farmer Brown, the barn is very cold at night. We'd like some electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. It was bad enough the cows had found the old typewriter in the barn. Now they wanted electric blankets. No way, said Farmer Brown. No electric blankets. So the cows went on strike. They left a note on the barn door. Sorry, we're closed. No milk today. No milk today, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard the cows busy at work. Click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. The next day, he got another note. Dear Farmer Brown, the hens are cold too. They'd like electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. The cows were growing impatient with the farmer. They left a new note on the barn door. The note said, closed, no milk, no eggs. No eggs, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard them. Click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. They're typing something else. Cows that type, hens on strike. Who ever heard of such a thing? How can I run a farm with no milk and no eggs? Farmer Brown was furious. Farmer Brown got out his own typewriter. Dear cows and hens, there will be no electric blankets. You are cows and hens. I demand milk and eggs. Sincerely, Farmer Brown. Duck was a neutral party. So he brought the ultimatum to the cows. He's taken the letter out to the barn. The cows held an emergency meeting. All the animals gathered around the barn to snoop, but none of them could understand moo. All night long, Farmer Brown waited for an answer. Duck knocked on the door early the next morning. He handed Farmer Brown a note. Dear Farmer Brown, we will exchange our typewriter for electric blankets. Leave them outside the barn door and we will send Duck over with the typewriter. Sincerely, the cows. Farmer Brown decided that this was a good deal. He left the blankets next to the barn door and waited for the duck to come with the typewriter. Look at how warm and cozy they are now with all their blankets on. The next morning, he got a note. Dear Farmer Brown, the pond is quite boring. We'd like a diving board. Sincerely, the ducks. Click, clack, quack. Click, clack, quack. Clickety, clack, quack. Look what they got. They got their diving board. That's the end. Thanks for listening. Bye-bye.